What is up, YouTube? We are back for a show and tell, finally! Finally! This is two days of thrifting chucked into one show and tell. One show and tell, man. And I hit 500 subs. I hit 500 fucking subs. To others, it's fuck all. To me, it's fucking pretty sweet. Thank you, everyone that watches, gives thumbs up, and enjoys the content. You're the star. You are the stars. If I ain't gonna fucking blah blah blah, let's just fucking do this. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's show and tell, man. I'm gonna fucking show and I'm gonna fucking tell. I'm back. Started, I have just dropped, just dropped on eBay. Because I promised that when I get 500 subscribers, I will sell some dog shit day mugs. Now, I had a problem when I was getting my mugs. I smashed a few by accident. The trip home was a bit bumpy. So I have seven packs. I'm only doing seven packs. Type in on eBay. The first seven, get it, you fucking bang off this video and get on eBay. First seven, the so type in and buy, they, it is Dog Shit Day Mug Pack. Dog Shit Day Mug Pack, that's all you gotta type in. There's only seven available. Not cheap, because it wasn't cheap buying them. I'm sorry. And you gotta cover your own postage. <laughs> But hey, they'll sell. The people that want them the most, they'll sell. International buyers, a bit heavy, so it's gonna cost a bit for uh, shipping, just saying. But anyway, you got the VHS Thrifter mug, you got the Dog Shit Day mug, and you got the VHS Stubby Holder. That's my 500 subs. 500 subs. I said I would sell it. I've only got seven. I'll do more later on. Only if these first seven sell. It ain't cheap, but it wasn't cheap getting them. So jump on there, just type in what I said. But let's do show and tell, let's do it. Let's not worry about fucking 500 subs. Let's not worry about this shit. If you want that, you just go get it. Just go get it and I'll post it to you, come on. All right, let's do it. Okay, so the first thrift store I went to. So remember this is two days worth. I don't count this as a pair of jeans, okay? So I haven't broken my jean virginity yet. But I found these, let's see this little tag here, West. Does anyone know this West brand? West. Anyway, I couldn't really find too much on them. So these are like purplish. They look like a dark purple to me, I think. They're not brown. I'm not colorblind. I'm pretty sure they're purple. Anyway, these jeans, these jeans cost me six bucks. Six bucks. Well, they're not jeans. Pants. Pants. They're not jeans. They're not jeans. I haven't broken my jean virginity yet. I'm counting them as pants, but they're kind of jeans. I'm not counting them as jeans. Anyway, so these pants, these surfy fucking pants. Six bucks. And uh, we're thinking we can turn these into with not many listed, and they might take a while, but I think just because of the design, and uh, the cool purplish hip, some hippie, some hippie fucker will want these. I reckon we'll get 50 bucks in the kitty for these. 50 bucks. I've got a good feeling, got a good feeling. Move on, move on, come on. This I was pretty stoked about finding. Paid uh, $6, $6 for this shirt. 1995 vintage Tasmanian Devil shirt. This print, like, when you see that, this print on it is like embroidered on it or something. I don't know, it's weird. It's fucking cool. Anyway, I reckon I can get about 50 bucks for this. Look at all the Tasmanian Devil stuff that goes, goes for over 50 bucks. So, 
vintage uh, Tasmanian Devil. What do you reckon? You like it? It's only a size. Uh, it's only a size medium, but that will sell. So that's 50 bucks for the kitty, right? Meow. I'm not gonna lie. I'm digging. I'm kind of digging uh, looking through all the clothes. So looking forward to my next thrift, which when this comes out on Thursday, I'll probably be thrifting for next week's episode, and I cannot fucking wait. Footy boots. Uh, Diary of a Flipper, if you don't know Diary of a Flipper, sub the Diary of a Flipper. Uh, he loves his footy boots. These are beautiful boots, and I cleaned them up so nice. F50s, Adidas. They're beautiful. I paid $9 for them. $9 for these beauties. I reckon I'll get about uh, 60 bucks for them. And footy season coming up. They're pretty sweet. They're really, really nice. Too bad I'm an unco prick and I can't play footy anymore. I won't tell you what happened in my last match. <laughs> Found this uh, women's uh, East Perth Royals uh, Western Australian Football League. This is the 2016 inaugural uh, season uh, on field training uh, jersey that they wear. As you see, the women's uh, size 12, so for a uh, smaller woman. So, yep, Royals women. Uh, that one cost me six dollars as well. I should get about thirty bucks for that. Thirty bucks for that, probably twenty. I'll take twenty, but uh, I should get about thirty bucks for that because it's pretty fucking sweet. And Royals fans like their merch. I got for a dollar. Got for a dollar this uh, Simpsons. Simpsons uh, VHS tape. Call of the Wild. This is one of the first uh, Simpsons videos that came out when they released all the uh, Simpsons videos um, when Simpsons first started. Uh, I can only get 10 bucks for this, but 10 bucks is fine from a dollar. Like I said, turning one dollar and fifty cents into uh, 10 bucks and all that with the videos and all that. It's not rocket science, it's fucking money for jam. Alrighty, next item. Cost me two bucks. It was this uh, Street Capcom, uh, Cap blah, blah, blah. Capcom uh, Street Fighter Zero Two uh, PlayStation One. Now it says it's a compact disc. Now me and uh, Game On Couple uh, Craig were discussing this, and PlayStation One games um, had the black underneath it, so we're not sure if this is a Japanese one or not. Not a hundred percent sure about this. Cannot put this in the kitty. I was going to smash this, I told Craig today when I was messaging him I'm going to smash it uh, on camera for fun, but I'm not going to smash it because I'm still going to do some more research on this because I'm not sure about this. Um, let me know in the comments, anyone that has any idea, but I put it in and it's not a music CD. It's not a music CD and I don't have a PlayStation 1 anymore, so not sure. Alright, pick up for two bucks, nothing in the kitty. Now before I move on, before I move on. My American managers, Tracy and Tommy. Yeah, I call them my managers. They look out for me. They look out for me. They look out for all us Aussies as well. They look out for us all. Anyway, I go on their lives now and then. I just pop on and I just go on. Let's just take a commercial break and uh, if they invite you to come on to a live, you go on to their live. Three strikes and you're out. Come on. If they ask you to go on a live, you go on their live. Let's just go to this. Go to this. Are you subscribed? to Tommy and Tracy's channel? You fucking not. Are you fucking shitting me? Well, ain't this fucking dog shit. Let me tell you something. Tommy and Tracy, they do the fucking greatest lives you've ever seen. And they will invite you. They will invite you. Oh, oh there's Tommy giving me a little texty text. Oh, there's Tracy. There's a little text from Tracy right there. It's an invitation. Invitation to come live. To come live. Don't fucking say no. Don't say no. Don't say no. If they invite you live, don't fucking do it. Don't fucking do it. That's dog shit to them. That's dog shit. I was on their live and they, 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 they helped me hit 500. 500 subs. <sighs> alright, they've invited you. They've invited you to come on live, but you've said no. That's alright. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> It's okay, it's only strike one. You might have been busy. You might have been busy cooking your little stir fry, 
making your little roast potatoes, or you just fucking just couldn't be fucked. You just couldn't be fucked. Whoa! That's only strike one. They asked you again. They asked you again and you said no. You said no a second time. Second time you've said no. That is dog shit. That is fucking dog shit, man. That's fucking rude. That's rude. You don't fucking say no a second time. But we'll let it slide. Let it slide. It slided. They asked you for a third time to come on their live. Why, why, didn't, why didn't you go on their live? Well, why didn't you go on their live? It's disrespectful. Don't, don't fucking not go on their live after a third fucking invitation, man. <laughs> Who says no to a third fucking live, man? Who says no? Tommy and Tracy don't fucking deserve this, man. You're out, buddy. You're fucking out. You're fucking out of here. Third strike and you're fucking out. You're not gonna get invited again. Third strike and you're gone, mate. You're fucking gone. Third strike and you're fucking out. You're fucking out of here. Don't be one of those third strike motherfuckers. Don't be a third strike motherfuckers. It's right there. Tommy and Tracy, they do heaps of lives. Check out. Get on it. Get on them. Do it. Do this. Do it now. Fuck this fucking video off. Fuck my video off now. Fucking get out of it. Go fucking type their names in and fucking sub to that shit. Sub it. Third strike and you're fucking out of here, buddy. You're gone. Done. There you have it, three strikes and you're out. If they ask you three times, you don't come on, you're out of here. We got this Western Australian football jersey. It's only a extra small. Um, this one cost me five bucks, but uh, the West Perth Falcons supporters, they'll froth on this. They will froth on this. And I should get 30 to 40 bucks for this. Um, I'm gonna put 40 in the kitty. I'll more likely get uh, more likely get 30. But uh, nice jersey. I don't go for them. I go for Peel Thunder, two-time premiership champions. I really like this next piece. This is a beautiful shirt. It really is total 90. I don't know if you've ever heard of it because I never have. This Nike shirt. The feel of it is so nice. This doesn't sell, I'll be keeping it for me. It is an XXL. Um, I think it will go pretty quick. T90. So if you've ever, uh, if you've never heard of that, have a look at that. But they go all right on there when I looked it up. Um, I'll probably only get 30 bucks for it. Uh, 30 bucks. I paid $5 for it. I'm stoked with $5 for that. It's really nice and it's uh, nice and, nice and uh, sticky. Happy with that? 30 bucks for the kitty. Next up I found this, um, this is the one on the corner of the screen where I said, can you guess what it is? This is in a, still got new tags, uh, official NHL uh, Vancouver Canucks ice hockey shirt. This is nice, I like this. Um, it is only a size, it's only a size medium. Um, that's all right, but the thing is that I found with it, there is a little hole in the back. There's a little hole in the back there. But it's not very big, so I'll show that on the photos. Um, I still reckon I can get, uh, I still reckon with NHL stuff, I can get 30 bucks for that. I'll take 20, but I reckon I can get 30 bucks for that. That's a really nice shirt, uh, the Canucks one. Very nice. But I go for the Penguins! Yes, I go for the penguins, so I'm not going to keep this one for myself. Very nice piece for five bucks. I'm happy with that. It's weird. I'm loving. I'm loving. I'm loving getting clothes. I, lo I love going through it all now. It's cool. Probably missed that much fucking shit when I went there, though. There was probably that much good stuff, and I missed it all. Three more things left. Now this next thing. 
I'm not even going to put a shout out down there because everyone fucking watches uh, Rally Roots. Who doesn't watch Rally Roots? We all watch Rally Roots. You're a dick if you don't watch Rally Roots. What is wrong with you? But if it wasn't for their show, just like everyone else's shows, that's why you should be watching each other's content, you wouldn't know about certain brands. I didn't even know uh, Tom. I didn't even know Tommy Bahama from your mama. I only say from your mama because of their show. Bahama, Tommy Bahama from your mama because of Rally Roots. Now I cannot. I don't know really if this one's going to be worth that much. I've looked it up and what I think I can get for it is meh. But to still find one in Perth, Western Australia, what the fuck? I didn't even know they existed in Australia. Has anyone, tell me in the comments, in Australia found a Tommy Bahama? Because it spun me out. I was, I had a, I had a thrifting erection. I couldn't believe it. The lady at the counter had to come over and bring me some tissues because I finished before I even began. So in respect to them, find uh, me finding my, uh, because of their show, finding it, I'm going to uh, pay a little homage. You can't present a Tommy Bahama from your mama without a little bit of Cali's World uh, thingy-majiggy on. Backwards bandana style. So if we're doing it like Rally Roots, we're gonna fucking do it like them, man. So there's me Tommy Bahama from your Amama. Right there. Hey, look, nothing special. Just your average fucking, just your average uh, shirt. Just your average shirt. I actually thought Tommy Bahama shirts were like Hawaiian shirts, but I was wrong. I spun the fuck out when I saw it. What does SP mean? Small penis? So I paid six bucks for this. I reckon I can get 30 bucks for it. Am I undercutting myself? Let me know in the comments if you would sell it for more. Uh, Cause I probably won't have it listed until next week anyway. Cause I'm a bit slow at listing. I'd rather buy shit than list it. Um, so that's my Tommy Bahama from your mama shirt. First one ever. That's a good area that I go to. I find some. I found some good stuff there. I found some good stuff. So yeah. Oh, I'm sweating with this off. How do you wear this all day, Kelly? You wear this all day. I'm sweating. Two more things. Two more things. We don't want to make it too long and boring for y'all. Uh, second last thing is this uh, football jersey, uh, Zambia, country Zambia. Um, I found this for five dollars, and I reckon I can get about forty to forty to thirty dollars for this one. Um, looks like it's a slow mover. Um, don't ask me why I brought it because I'm still learning clothes and all that. But uh, why not? I liked it. It's got a nice feel to it and all that as well. Um, I don't know this whole fucking single stitch thing that you all guys talk about. It's got. 17 stitches, triple stitch, quadruple stitch logo, infinity stitch. It's an infinity stitch shirt, an infinity stitch shirt. So that's a Zambia. Uh, we'll say 40 for the kitty. For the kitty. One more item and then we're gonna reveal the kitty. Now who doesn't like Fraggle Rock? I got this for 50 cents. Whoa. I don't know if you know your Fraggle Rock characters. This is Moki. This is Moki from Fraggle Rock. This one uh, comes across a little bit rare when I was looking up Moki. Uh, not many on there for sale, so that means I can put my price up a little bit more. Fucking love Fraggle Rock. One of the greatest shows ever. Anyway, I was looking at this and I think I can get about 50 bucks. So 50 bucks, I'll be laughing, so we'll put 50 bucks in the kitty. Moki's looking good. Uh, part of me doesn't want to sell it. Um, so I will put it at 50 bucks so it doesn't go and usually when I do that they sell and uh, yeah, so cool. <laughs> I love the Fraggles. Alright Fraggle, you can sit here for the rest of the show. Alright, okay. It's time to bring up the kitty! $55.50 and we're going to make a return of $420. $420. Oh, 
Oh no, the dog is barking. The dog doesn't like the kitty. But the kitty doesn't lie. The kitty doesn't lie. $420. Woo! From 55 bucks. Holy shit. Oh man, my fucking bandana is making me sweat. I've got drippy drippy all over. Fuck off, kitty. Fuck off. Get out of here, you fucking kitty. $420 from $55.50 Potential, that's before fees, that's before taxes and everyone pays for their own postage I'm happy as a pig and shit with that What do you think about my score that I got? That was two days worth though because I took a little bit more time in the closed apartment area Phantom butthole <laughs> Okay Thanks for watching guys, I'm over 500 now, unless about 10 of them have dropped and I'm under 400 and um, Click like, subscribe, do what the fuck you want, it is your life, I'm not going to tell you what to do, but it always helps. And I'm going to be back at you with some lives coming up, uh, I'm going to have to do some type of giveaway for 500 uh, uh, subscribers because I thank you so much. Uh, me and Kelly, we're going to do our Chase the Ace again, coming up very soon. Uh, and um, we're going to do um, Trivial Pursuit questions. Trivial Pursuit questions for uh, Chase the Ace. Uh, that'll be fun. We'll do that again on a live. Don't know when we'll do it, but we'll do it soon. Um, and then I'm back to my normal programming, which is Tuesdays, right along, and Thursdays, uh, like we're here doing the show and tell. Thanks everyone for watching. I'm hot in this shit. I want to take it off. I want to take it off now. That was a really good kitty. A very good kitty. Thanks for watching everyone. Click like, subscribe, do what the fuck you want. I'll be back at you like Cleopatra. Bang!